it can't be play all the time, and although pearl diving might look like play, it is really hard, skillful work. The natives stay underwater from three to four minutes, crawling along the bottom, filling baskets with shells, and then returning to the surface. It's not fun weaving your way through coral gardens, never knowing when you may meet some gliding monster like this, a manatee, duyong, or slough, resembling some prehistoric dinosaur resurrected from antiquity. Malignant, evil, an apparition from the unknown. But the divers are more agile than their clumsy visitor, easily elude his gigantic bulk and make their way to the surface where the boatmen sit with poised spears to challenge the ugly monster should he too come to the surface. again to search for the opaque little stone that someday at fabulous prices will adorn fair ladies of the western world.
Take me there to Zamboanga in the island far away where the rustling of the palm trees and the moral maidens say, Come you here to Zamboanga and the shores of Zambo Bay. Here is life, also adventure. There are pearl beds neath the sea. And at times the moral raiders may on the warpath be. But it's not mundane existence, and it's strongly calling me. Take me there to Zamboanga. It is there I want to be when the shadows of the sunset on the winters seem to me to be saying, off for Zambo and the plotted Zulu Sea. Thank you.